it would appear that Captain Titus had forgotten to reload. No matter. We have a sword. We can make this work. So. Just let it happen. <laughs> I don't think we're in a very strong bargaining position here. Uh, it's gonna happen. Oh, yeah. Let's walk majestically across this bridge. Just blue walking death. My battle brothers and I must secure any operational warlord class titans before the orcs. If you had to pick a band of brothers character, who would this man be? Hmm. Who would that man be? Yeah. Probably Garnier. Played by who? I don't know the guy's name, but he was in, uh... The next thing I saw him in was Catch Me If You Can. He played one of the uh, cops in the seat. The one who was telling the joke. And asked uh, Tom Hanks, Hey, why don't you ever tell jokes? It was that guy. He plays guard here. Hmm. I haven't seen him anything else besides that. Okay, fair enough. Maybe it was a very concentrated career. Yeah, about, pretty much about it. <laughs> Everybody else who played bit parts in that show became famous, and anybody else who had a speaking role, minus uh, uh, James McAvoy. Well, no. I'll take that back. The red-headed guy was pretty famous. He was in uh, Homeland and some other stuff. The red-headed guy? Yeah. Like the awkwardly geeky long-limbed Irishman? I don't think he's Irish. I think he's British. Fair enough. But he, yeah, he's the main character in Homeland. Or it was. I, I'd have to watch it. Yeah, you would. Uh, also, sorry, I'm trying to move move my chair over my foot. <laughs> um, he was also in Your Highness. Also, have not seen. And you've not seen I Your just Highness. Don't follow the television, man. It's not a show. It's a I, movie. I watch my movies, and I just, I just, I don't. Uh... This is a movie. Your Highness. You've never seen the movie Your Highness with uh, Don and Danny McBride and James Franco, where they played knights. No. No. See the Knight's Tale. No, this is like a funny ripoff of it. Okay, so again, why would I watch that? Because it's fucking hilarious. Okay. Yeah. I mean, do you mean that in a in a funny ripoff sort of way, or is it actually yeah. funny? Well, it has its moments of being funny. It's a funny ripoff. Movie. Okay. Again, you're you're not you're not selling it. You're just like, no. hey, I mean, I like it when things are low ball to me, yeah. like pre -di pre digested. Uh, just take a look at it one day. Okay. You're I have a, it has a special place in my heart. It was the uh, first time I met my kid's grandfather uh -huh. uh, after I knocked up his daughter. <laughs> so the first time I Good meet time her, as any. Yeah, I picked that movie, and there's a part in the movie where the guy can't cut off a uh, Danny McBride can't cut off a uh, Minotaur horn uh -huh. for a prize, so he cuts off his dick and straps it around his neck. So better or worse than Black Knight? Oh, Black, no better. Better than Black Knight. <laughs> oh, so much better than Black Knight. That's a whoa. That's a low movie. On my end, and for my end, that was a pretty bad movie. Almost up there with Pluto Nash. <laughs> I've only seen pieces of it. I, I saw like two minutes of it. I was like, God, this is crap. I don't want to see any more. Thank you. Though. Yeah. Like, nope. Not like it. Oh shit! Just the right amount of roll. But yeah, I'd highly recommend just watching it. Just your just, highness. Your Highness. Also has Kara Knightley in it. How would you acquire this film? Through a digital service, or...? Uh, I think I have it. I can let you borrow it one day when I find it. No rush. Yeah. No, no, <laughs> I didn't think it would be. When I find it, I'll let you know. When you unbury it, when you zoom it from your things. Yeah. I mean, I, I will pray for your youngest to find a way to, like, Daddy, look, and just, like, eat the whole thing. Thank you. <laughs> that way she can just, she can internalize the happiness of this film. No, there's there were a pretty uh, at the time let's say big name actors. He had like James Franco. Uh, what the heck's the girl's name? Who's in? Uh, yeah, James Franco was in the first of the three New Apes films. You know, yep. he's a big deal. He's also in the Disaster Artist. He is. Yeah. He embodies the Tommy Wiseau. Uh, yeah, I heard heard he does a pretty good job. I heard mixed results, but I still want to see it. I like it's it's an SNL skit level of performance, but it's such a. I guess passion project performance that it's okay. Okay, don't fight over nothing. <laughs> we we'll call that one the wagon clearer. Not sure why. Yeah, you had uh, Danny McBride when he's and down was a big movie. Karen Knightley. Danny McBride. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like he capped out with Tropic Thunder. Uh, he's and down was his high point for me. That was about it. Okay. He's and okay. down. He was okay in. Not he's and down. He's 
fine. Drop the dummy. Okay. Drop the dummy was okay. He's got him down. He's pretty good. He was the pyrotechnical artist. Artiste. Outdoor. He was pretty good and also uh, the end. Uh, what was the movie about again? Just a bunch of people. Just a bunch of celebs. Uh, yeah. In a house. In a house. They all play themselves. Yeah. Yeah. In a house party. Uh, James Franco's no, no, no. house I get, party. I get the setup, but why would you watch this? I heard funny things about it, then I watched it, I was like, what the hell did I get myself into? <laughs> like, this, that was worse than your highness. Mm -hmm. So, if you're, if you're putting that, like, Black Knight, The End, your highness is a little bit above The End. Did you ever watch the interview? No. In the interest? Yeah, I came close to watching it, and then... Uh, I'm just one of the... Uh, to, to me, movies aren't a big thing for me. Like, TV right. shows are better. Because you can yes. get a more storyline into it. What? Yeah. Well, it, okay, you can spend fewer minutes cons consecutive together watching it, but I, when you say more storyline, I can test that. Yeah, it depends on the show. It depends on the... Okay, so take uh, The Dark Tower. Yeah. Better off as a TV series, maybe on AMC or HBO. Better, better off as a book and a Broadway play, and that's it. A Broadway play? Yes. But you got to have some musical lines to it. Ja Hugh Jackman, not Jack Human, as I was going to say. Ja Jack Human's pretty good. Jack <laughs> Human's strong. Uh, Hugh Jackman playing the lead role. That was the first time, actually, the first time I ever uh, saw Hugh Jackman. The second time, actually, I should say. He was in uh, X-Men just got done and he was doing a Broadway play of Oklahoma. And it was on PBS. And I thought it was just a funny thing. Like, yeah, Wolverine singing about Oklahoma and how the winds go sleeping down planes. This is odd. Really odd. But he, this guy's not supposed to I'm not used to this. Yeah, like, nope. Not cool. Cool. What do you mean? If, looking back, I think he like, wants to be Wolverine forever. I, mean, I know it pays, but no, he would like to be remembered as a as an artist. Artist. You know? I will say that uh, Tom Hardy is, is now being like nominated when someone retires from something. Like next 007, Tom Hardy. <laughs> next Wolverine, Tom Hardy. Like, Please use this man in something again. Like then on something Tom, physical. Like anything that like they're like oh okay we're gonna cast Tom Hardy as everything now. Like we're we're doing we're doing another movie of Les Miserables, Tom Hardy, for which role all of them. We are just CGI the shit out of that dude. We'll play both male and female leads. Like, Over yeah. Jeremy Renner. Yeah, no. Jeremy Renner. Uh, I don't know really fan of Jeremy Renner. He's a pretty good air though. Hawkeye. This is Jeremy Renner, right? He plays yes. Hawkeye. Yeah. He did Wind River. Yeah. He was an all right performance in that too. He was in the town, man. You know, never seen it. I feel like movie. he's a better director than he is an actor, I feel. Better director? Tell yes. us people he was trying to do the Batman movie for. Oh. Then after uh, whatever it was, the uh, movie last year that happened in December that took him made, they took him off of it? Yep. Being Batman was in that movie. Yeah. Yeah. He's so. okay with that though. He's okay not being Batman anymore. Yeah, I think he was okay with Batman after the first Dawn of Justice film. Like, ugh. You're not gonna be Batman? That's cool. But basically you're saying you don't you don't believe that. Depen Affleck is a better writer than performer. It depends on the movie and depends on the role and depend it all depends on. All like, depends on. Yeah. Okay. It depends on the situation. Like directing Batman, probably not the best. Directing uh, Man plus McCannon. I heard the town's pretty good. And did a pretty good job. So maybe that. Yeah, probably really good. But I haven't seen it. Did you ever see Argo? Argo? Nope. But I heard that was uh, most of that was a crap of shit. Like they took some things out of it. Based on true events. What? Like, yeah. All so, of the stories are based on other stories that were more or less true, I guess. Like, they took small bits and were like, we're just gonna, for movie's sake, we're just gonna do this. Like, it's a good story, but no one's really gonna buy how it actually happens. They don't want to sit a seven and a half hour movie. It's, it's too exceptional. You, yeah. you have to fake it. You have to do something fake. Like, oh, okay. Uh oh. Could be in trouble here. Got the croc copter coming after you. I do. This is the pride of the Orc fleet. Oh shit, did I? No, I don't want to tear it off. R to bed, that's right. Come back around. No, stop, stop that. This is a bad time to, uh... Let's see, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna get off there? No, I'm not, I'm just gonna go down the ship. What was the button again? Was it, uh, Q? No, it's grenade. Is it C? What? Is it X? Oh, you're fury. We figured out last time. The last time was so long ago. Oh, that's what it is. What is it? Uh, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't? I did not. 
I just pushed it, and then he died. You're about to die, speaking of that. Yep. You're getting fucked up. I gotta get off this thing. Just give me a couple more seconds. I'm almost ready. I'm a bit close up. Okay. Psych. Wasn't ready. And you drifted away. Typical. Oh, good. Just what I needed. A challenge. You gonna go get some help out of him? Yep. Persuade yeah, him to surrender yeah. his life force. Mouth, brain pan, everything really. Whew, that's rough. <laughs> what? Just to some uh, experimental dental surgery. It's fine. Just imagine actually seeing that in real war, like coming through and all of a sudden this. Just fighting off each other and just baying the sword right through the mouth. A sword with moving teeth on Yeah. Some things you just don't remember. I wouldn't want to get yeah, um, me. Yep. Take you. I'll take a nice little glass of milk with that. Yeah, shot through the wall. No pala cart. Lucky ricochet. No pala cart? No pala cart. No, no a la carte. Gotcha. No vampires. <laughs> Nope. Yeah, fair enough. You wave? Another wave? Nope. Nope. Get back to it. Yeah, this, this sequence has always been like this. Remember, it's meant to be like, yeah, you're you're on the edge. You're not fully masterful. You're very vulnerable, you superhuman you. Whoop. Yep. <laughs> oh. Good gameplay? I don't think so, but it is, uh, it is tense. It is. And your fellows aren't helping. Like, at all. Like, at like, all. Uh, Great. Help. Captain's got this right. He's done this shit before, hasn't he? We've started the battery map. How? All right, by crashing something orky into something else orky. That tends to work. Hey, this is like recent events, right? We're just uh, <laughs> yeah. taking a quarter a little faster. Well, I think they 600,000 dead orcs reported. Someone's only 25 mile in Arizona. How fish one? 7,000 above light speed. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> That's maybe a little too much, but sure, yeah. Yeah, impossible. Quite a bit. Part two, pink was it? Yeah, I don't understand this transition, but yeah, sure, why not? We ejaculated ourselves. Now you're going to do the Inquisition? Uh, no one expects them, that's for sure. They got my health black, so that's nice. You got your health black? We got my health blacked. Yep. We must hurry. It was a proud moment in my life. Well, we'll tackle this on the next time. Brothers! See ya.